Top of the stretch for the first division of the $70,000 Abe Lincoln Stake for two-year-old paces at Maywood Park. Here they come. And they're off. That's Keystone Rodeo going for the lead, followed by Look My Way and along the inside, Outrage. They race into the first turn. Keystone Rodeo went a little wide into the turn. And it's Outrage who has the lead. Look My Way is second. Keystone Rodeo dropped in third. Yankee Cruiser is fourth by a widening three. The Force of Magic is fifth by two. In sixth is All-American Captor by two and a half. And Coronet Hanover is the trailer. They are fairly strung out as they race quickly to the first quarter and pass that timer in 27 and two. It's outraged on top by a length and a quarter. And now Miller will give him a second quarter breather. Look My Way is second by a good two and a half. Keystone Rodeo is third. Out of fourth is Yankee Cruiser by five. The Force of Magic gaps in fifth to the outside in six. All-American Captor by three, trailing Coronet Hanover. And off stride coming into the stretch was Keystone Rodeo. Keystone Rodeo made a brief break. He's now back on stride. Outrage goes by the half, 57 seconds. Gets a 29 and three second quarter breather. It's Outrage who leads it by a neck up on the outside. Here comes Yankee Cruiser and Yankee Cruiser with a rush. Takes the lead and opens up by three. Up on the outside, here comes All-American Captor into second. Suddenly, Outrage is dropping back terribly, and he's pushing back, look my way. Also having to grab up there was Force of Magic as they race to the three quarters. The leader by two and a half lengths is Yankee Cruiser. His entry made All-American Captor a second by two and a half. In third is Keystone Rodeo, three quarters, 126 and four, 29 and four for the third quarter. It's Yankee Cruiser by a length and a half. All-American Captor is second, followed in third by Keystone Rodeo. It's five lengths to fourth, where it's Look My Way up on the outside. The Force of Magic, they're in the stretch. It's Yankee Cruiser, the leader. Here comes All-American Captor on the outside. Yankee Cruiser, though, will hold on coming to the wire. All-American Captor second, Keystone Rodeo third, and it looked like the Force of Magic was fourth, 156 and three. In the second race, 1A Yankee Cruiser was first, 1B All-American Captor was second, 3 Keystone Rodeo was third. We await the posting of the fourth place finisher to complete the trifecta. Unofficially, the exacta is 1-3. Returning to the winner's circle with his ninth win in his young career is 1A Yankee Cruiser. He's a two-year-old son of Art Escape out of the Jate Lobel Mare Yankee Classic. He's owned by Brian Pinsky Stable Incorporated, Nick Barbareri, and the Pinsky Stables. They are of Illinois, Ontario, and Minnesota. Trained by Brian Pinsky, who's in the winner's circle, driven by Dean McGee, making the first Division A Lincoln stake presentation, our race secretary, Doc Narotsky. Yankee Cruiser pacing to a winning mile of 156 and three-fifths.